Hello everyone. Today I am going to explain about the RBS that is Remaining Bus Simulation in TS Master. Uh, that is nothing but a database that uh, contains message and signals. By using this also we can vary the signal value. Uh, it is a, a window, new window of TS Master. Uh, for uh, the RBS simulation is in simulation window. Uh, here the can rbs simulation this is a window we need to add database to uh, get a signals and message for that i go at analysis then add database here show can database i'm adding one database here okay uh, here i'm taking uh, dashboard database no. it contain one node with the seven message and eight signals here it is okay this is a single node which contain transmission and uh, reception messages signals and all okay uh, let's enter to the rbs uh, simulation in simulation window mm, yeah it created already one node and because it has a one node that's why it created one node this are uh, this is a dashboard network one node is created it has transmission and reception message here it has a signal uh, transmission signal and the reception signal also uh, here is a reception signal it's a transmission messages okay and take on the transmission message by double clicking this we can activate all the signals and here uh, by clicking on uh, that you can deactivate the node here if we are deactivated this node uh, even though these signals are um, messages are activate we can't send any message in trace window if we are deactivated this node let's show one Here I'll give uh, uh, yeah, I'll give one uh, headlight value as one. Okay, then I'll transmit that. Okay. In the trace window, there is no signal. As the node is deactivated, so there is no messages transmitted. I activated that signal I'll start the confirmation I'll give as a one okay. here the message is passed this is how the transmission uh, signal value can be changed by using RBS okay. and uh, I'll give speed value here okay as um, 30 okay uh, yeah message is passed See? the uh, 30 is a value if this is a hexadecimal value the message will take hexadecimal and signal will take decimal value as a 30 okay uh, then let's start a uh, configure panel so that uh, I'll go at panel. I'll create one uh, speedometer. I'll take. A, I'll start with a gauge. Okay. Just for a display, you need to add taken. Now I'll add one uh, scroll bar. Okay by double clicking in this uh, i'll add signal can signal i'm adding okay i'll take as a speedometer yeah okay for this also same signal i'm taking that is can signal in that i'll take a speedometer okay yes added let's see how the panel will work according to the rbs simulation now i'll uh, to give 
ஸ்டார்ட் ஃபஸ்ட் ஸ்டார்ட் கான்ஃபிகரேஷன் தென் கிலோமீட்டர் அஸ் ட்வெண்ட்டி சாரி ஃபஸ்ட் ஸ்டார்ட் கான்ஃபிகர் அண்ட் தென் கிவ் ட்வெண்ட்டி அஸ் அது சிக்னல் இஸ் பாஸ்ட் தென் தட்ஸ் செக் இந்த பேமெண்ட் யா திஸ் இஸ் ஆல்சோ டிஸ்பிளேயிங் ட்வெண்ட்டி ஃபார் அவர் ரெஃபரன்ஸ் லெட்ஸ் டேக் ஒன் இன்புட் அண்ட் அவுட் புட் வேல்யூ டூ ஹியர் ஐ டேக் ஒன் வேல்யூ டூ த சேம் சிக்னல் ஐ ஆட் ஹியர் கேன் சிக்னல் ஸ்பீடோ மீட்டர் ஹியர் இட் இஸ் ஐ ஆட் சேம் சிக்னல் ஹியர் லெட்ஸ் செக் here i'll give as a mm, i'll give 40 okay this message is passed here let's check in panel yeah it is displaying the 40 in the display unit in the bar also and input and output value also okay mm, rbs also it changes yeah. here it is a 40 same value which we changed in rbs that will display in the panel by copying the script uh, it is a raw message signal database message uh, script and um, while using can we are using database right now i am using rbs value copy the script then go to the program by program also we can control the panel and also we can change the signal value from program i'll show how uh, let's um uh, i'll arrange uh, okay program here program window let's enter to the on start and i create one on start as a speed speed okay apply here i need to write a program i copied that script and here i pasted here just i pasted here we we gave 40 as a value so it shows 40 here uh, this is a channel and the node and network the signal is added to the message and the value which gave gave 40 now i'll give the value as 20 and i'll run the script configuration and stop and start here and here also i'll stop and start okay the message is passing in trace window right and in display also it's showing 20 because we gave a 20 now let's give as a value here uh, as a 60 okay Showing 60 and displaying the 60 is a value by using the script yeah here also value 60 by using script also we can change rbs also we can change the panel means we can uh, send message using rbs as well as script here we can uh, uh, change the signal uh, to rolling counter and uh, crc and we can uh, give a limit rc limit here and um, take, um, 
yeah see um we need to stop the configuration then we can set a crc check some signal you can set, uh, set that to by selecting that signal in settings we have a uh, in database in, in which we have a database value and the last value which we are gave and the all we can set uh, all the data into zero then the rbs are to select mm, here also we can select in um, here the mp initialization code is generated it is automatically generate when we added database we uh, can uh, activate the signal by name as well as uh, address and the message with the name can um, by giving a true and false uh, at zero or one we can activate by using this script means code it is are the inbuilt functions okay um, finally we got to know that we can control the panel by using rbs means uh, rbs by deactivating we can't send any message this is all about rbs thank you